Hello and welcome back to The Witcher. So, we are going to go meet with Simon by the lake because we owe him a favor for letting us out of jail. Hopefully, he's not going to ask for too much or for something that we don't want to do because, well, that's not going to end well for him. But, you know, we, we deserve to hear him out. Or he deserves for us to hear him out because, well, he did let us out and he didn't ask for anything at the time apart from a favor. So, and we accepted that trade. So it's fair enough. Let's go see what he has to say. Uh, he is on this island, right? Just so that we're not going crazy. Yeah. Oh, he's actually real close. Alright, well that's good. That is fantastic. Ooh, that was alright. Slow okay. now. Yeah. I swear Roach gets more glitchy the more we play the game. Maybe I just notice them. Or play in a style that encourages them more. I don't know. Anyway, yes. Let's keep going. Uh, Roach is just stopping non-stop here. Like, we'll just be running normally and they'll just stop. Must be like a bump or something on the road that just then uh, knocks Roach off and then, like, the auto run just stops. Weird. Anyway, uh, th this way. Ah, uh, by the lake. This must be the lake. That makes a lot of sense, hey really. Oh, tried to go off-road and, well, see what we got. Oh, this is the place we saved. Oh, that's good. Uh, so he's just over... Ah, he's being easy. Come on, Roach. I told Roach to go right, is that? <laughs> that's how Roach goes right now. Roach goes left all the way to go right. That's just weird. Okay. Well, let's see. Oh, Simmons got some friends. Knew you were thick, Brambling, but that thick? To waltz and to me. What the hell's this? Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. He's come to kill ye. Oh, have I? What did he do to you, Simon? Me? To him? Twas him who did me wrong. Her son killed me, brother. Tricked him, betrayed him. I swore revenge. Hunted him across all the isles. Bugger always got away somehow. So now that is. High time we end this strife. Once and for all, no more questions, Geralt. Cut him down! I'll have as many questions as I want. No, I'm not a murderer. Out of the question, Simon. I'm no murderer. Not gonna kill him. Then you'll die at his side. Really? You're gonna try and fight us? Alright. Well, you know, that was just Attack! foolish. Best blade's not worth shite if a weak arm swinging it, eh? For a minute there, for a minute, I thought you'd do it. Thought you'd kill me. No. Yeah. Um. Yeah, well, I guess we'll go with this one. The top one's just wrong, so, yeah. Lucky for you, I have a different notion of honor than you Skelligers. Prefer to thank folk with a bottle of something strong, not murder. Tell no one what happened here, Witcher. Simon's got a spearside cousin on Speaker Rock. He learns what you've done here, he'll vow blood revenge. Won't rest till... Enough. Not another word about pride, feuds, or bonds of kinship. You can kill each other without my help from now on. That's interesting. Well, we'll take his goat hide. And I guess we paid off that debt. Well, I'll be honest with you. I thought that was going to take a little bit longer. Let's have a look at our quest. We haven't done this in a little bit. So, we've got possession. This is kind of our main quest. Let's go and uh, speak to Cirrus. Um, Cirrus? I think it's Cirrus, who is off on Spickerog. Okay, what else have we got? Second ship is in Velen. We're not going back to Velen yet. Fists of Fury is Einar. Where is Einar? Just if we can get multiple things done. He's still he's on Art Skellig? He's on Pharaoh. We may leave him for uh, when we're cleaning up a few things. Uh, Gwen, don't care. Old cards, don't care. Land Acid from the Arch Griffin. Yeah, that's back in Velen as well. Actually, I remember that one. That one we're leaving. Those two are Heart of Stone. Okay, what else have we got? We have the Contract Dragon. These are a little bit high level. Village Elder and Blandere. 
a little bit higher level as well. Lord of the Wood is in Valen. Valen, 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 Valen. All right. Cool. That's all the Witcher co Wait, we have no Witcher co Oh, wait, no. We have the four at the top. There's a very small number of Witcher contracts in Skellige. Interesting. And then we all have all of those. Most of them are in Valen. Or Novigrad. So I guess, actually, yeah. We Now that I'm looking at it, we pretty much just have possession. That's our only side quest that we've got sitting on us right now in Skellige. Then, we've got a few of the Witcher contracts, but I think actually after we finish Possession, we're probably on our way back to Velen to do side, to do side quests. I thought we had a lot more of Skellige left to do, but I guess, let's, let's have a look at the Isles. We've explored a lot of Ard Skellige. I guess Ard Skellige's kind of a little bit smaller. It's got a lot of empty space in it, which works, but yeah, okay. That's Spikarok over there. Yeah. Been over there. Apart from all these little islands around. Yeah, there's not that much left in Skell- we, I mean, we haven't been over here at all, have we? I mean, it says we've discovered the harbour, but I don't think we have. Uh, does it give us something? Uh, shipwrights working in this harbour considered best in the isles. Oh, no, we haven't been there. Uh, oh, I should figure out where we're going on this one. But yeah, I thought we had a ton more to do. I guess where we want to head out is probably control the harbour. And then we can head up here. Or we could head to the crossroads, which may have something. Probably doesn't have a boat there. We'd have to head down to uh, Rainvag. Uh, let's head back to Kirtrol. Or Kirtrolda. Yeah, okay. Um, I do want to kind of go to all the little islands as well, just to finish things up. Uh, I'm trying to think what we might do for that. Might have to be like an episode on its own or something like that, where we go off to these islands. Just to uh, see what's going on. Just a like, little boat episode. Might do one of those in Bell and one of those in Novigrad as well. Or we might do them all in one, which might be the best way Faster. to do it. I'm not going to go for every question mark, but like the ones on the isles down here, right? There, There's so many of them right in a row. Like, I know that these are smugglers' caches, right? All of those are both smugglers' cash. These are probably nothing. Uh, that's smugglers' cash, smugglers' cash. Yeah, all of those are smugglers' caches, right? Pretty much. But like these ones, these could be something. Like this one's all the way out there, although it looks like smugglers' cash, if I'm honest with you. Uh, that one could be something. That one could be something. There are some places where we could have a look. There might be monster nests as well, but yeah. Go, go. There's things for us to still do. Oh, perfect. Did it first try. Did it first try. Told you. It was brilliant. Oh, thank God. Doesn't it, We're in the same area, so we don't have to hear the uh, the ugliest man alive bit again. The same one over and over. Well. Come on, Roach. So that's the problem with breaking Roach. Occasionally you'll just break the entire game and then you'll just die. But yeah. Um... I think we may do some cleaning up of some question marks. We might do them like, or a better way of doing them might be like do a Witcher contract and then clear up some at the end of the episode or at the start of the episode or something like that. I think that might be a... I wasn't even doing anything that time. That's weird. Anyway. Um, yeah, I think that might be a better way to do it. Yeah, I don't know. I'll think about it at the time. But, yeah. We might actually even do main quest at some point. Move it! It's crazy. Because uh, I know that the main quest kind of... Oh, I didn't change my quest. Uh, I know where I'm going, but I didn't change the quest. Uh, possession. Yeah. I know Run, the main quest kind of gets moving after this part in the game. Like, I know that this is the point where things start speeding up towards, like, something. I don't know whether it's a conclusion or whether it's, like... Start speeding up towards like the second main part of the game. I hope that makes sense, but like it opens. I don't know whether it just opens up a whole bunch of new stuff to do or something, or whether it just goes right. It's pretty linear from here on out or stuff. Come on, Roach. So I want to get most of what we're doing done before that. Uh, I'm also not sure when Slow the now. DLC bl um, blocks out. There is a point of no return, but I think I think somebody we'll said it's uh, Mark. Like. Not, not the, like it says this is the point of no return, basically. Anyway, we'll see. Or it, it, it does like a, 
Are you sure you want to do this now, Geralt? You gotta get everything else you want to do finished before you can do this kind of thing. So, we'll see. Uh, is there any uh, question marks between here and there? Oh, there's nothing. We already did the only one there. So I guess it's both. It's the only thing that we've got to do. But yeah, it's interesting. Um, I'm actually really excited to get to like get to the DLC as well. Oh wow, we're really close to that really low poly whale. Yeah, yeah. The low poly whale's a little odd actually. Don't know why they've got that in there. I mean, it's cool to see. But they could have made it. Well, I suppose they made it more texture. It's gonna be a performance issue or something. Anyway, yes. That was me awkwardly trying to connect two parts of a conversation where uh, the phone rang and I had to do a cut. Hopefully that went very well and you didn't notice until I said anything, but that's unlikely. Uh, let's switch to our crossbow. Uh, well, I try not to sneeze and cause us up to uh, have another break in the episode. Well, you know, that failed. Right, well at least we're at the smuggler's cache. So I can just get off of our uh, boat here. Uh, now is this going to kill them? I think it only kills them if I'm on the boat. Okay, think about this. Fight? I suppose if I Damn go on the ugly. Oh god, they're fighting us here. That was the work. That worked. Oh, it looks like the ones that are here are actually weaker. Interesting. So it's not about being underwater necessarily, it's just about them being like sea creatures. Or like marked for being in the sea. Noise. Keep shooting them. Keep shooting them. I'll sort out our armor in a second. Right. Get on the boat. Get going. Don't sink. It's gonna be real bad if you sink. Doesn't look like it's catching up with us. That's good. I think it'll let us go. Right, now before we run into another problem, let's uh, sort out our over encumberedness. Um, for heavy armor, not looking that good really. Looking pretty bad for heavy armor. Uh, the boots are a worse version of our boots. Alright, well, there you go. Uh, guess we're dropping the blue sword because there's no reason for us to have the blue sword. Let's see what else we want to drop. Oh, these, definitely. Um, yeah, I'll drop those, drop those. How much more do we need to drop? Another 12. Wow. Probably means realistically we have to drop a heavy armor. A uh, thousand, oh, they're worth so much though. All of this is worth so much. We should sell something. When we get to Spikarog, that's uh, goal number one is find someone we can sell stuff to. Uh, hmm. I don't suppose we have like a potion that just allows us to skip this. Uh, like one that gives us temporary like carrying capacity. Uh, not that one, not that one, not that one. Okay, there's a lot of them that we have. I think I remembered one, which is... Oh, there we go. Yeah, this is it. The Fiend de uh, Decoction. Perfect. We'll have that. Leave our bag just sitting in the ocean. And off we go. Uh, is that Spickrog I can see up ahead, or is that... Oh, that's that island. I just need to go heavy to this side. The, uh... West. Another Smuggler's Cache. Uh, that stench. I, yeah. I'm just gonna leave it, I think. Uh, uh, yeah. We, we can't carry anything that we get from the smuggler's cache, which is my main reason for being like, we'll just leave it. Or just now. We may come back if we have an empty inventory, but until that point, it's a bit like, well, if we go there, we'll, you know, what, what are we get from doing that? 
am going to head over here, actually, because one, we might find a boat that isn't quite as battered. And two, I mean, it's an island off on its own. It's got a boat out the front of it. You can see the uh, boat over to the left. I just want to see what's going on here. What's up with this? That, that, is, that is a whole boat right there. That's kind of weird. Spoils of war. We see the spoils of war. Probably not in a while. Don't sink my boat. Okay. Uh, I would like to park at some point if that's possible. Hidden treasure. Interesting. Get off the boat. Get off the Geralt. That was almost amazingly bad. Hey, everybody. What's up? Yeah. Not much for me either. Geralt, that was just awful. Right. Finish him off. He gave us the free dodge. Triple kill. Perfect. Right. You get the main loot. Which is all this stuff. I know I didn't stop at the other one because we can't carry it, and then I stopped at this one. I realized this. That's fine. Uh, there's a hidden treasure somewhere. Okay. Uh, quite a large area, really. I kind of assumed it was going to be near the Drowners, but it could be over this way. Um, near that is shit. No. Ah, up the top. I got it. Uh, ooh, Bounty Hunters thing. The top tier. Uh, let's just have a look at it. I know we're being attacked, but let's have a look at it. Slightly better. It's light armor. We lose the vitality. We lose the piercing. Got a lot of resistance to bludgeoning and slashing. I don't think it's good enough. Uh, I think our current one has some really good bonuses on it, which is just kind of happy. Hey, why didn't I get my to kill? Who knows? That'll do it. Hey, you're not allowed to hit me while you are injured. Burn it and then get a next set of hits in. Nice. Do all of that. Do a little climb. Uh, I'll eat a mushroom. Get the rest of the loot. Okay, so that was the hidden treasure. Now we got the spoils of war. Uh, okay. Let's try something here. Didn't work. Oh, but this one. Seeing whether I can get them interested in a fight. Doesn't look like it. I think I'm going to have to head down there if I want to fight. Uh, there. Almost. Got it. Right, we got the fight going. Oh, that looked good. Yep, got that one. Let's get the next one over to shore. I hit it. Doesn't look like it. How about this one? It's so high up in the air. I know it just dived as I said that, but... Okay, this is close enough, right? I think the arrows are, or the bolts are running out of range. Luckily it came over it. Wait for, I was waiting for Igni to come back up so we can do that instantly. Uh, I assume that the fire goes out if they go underwater. Wasn't a knockdown? Interesting. 
Got it. Nice thing about them landing on land is we actually get their loot as well. Nice. Uh, let's grab the spoils of war. Uh, I assume it's down here, right? I don't know if we... Yeah, we haven't seen a spoils of war in ages. But that might be because we spent a long time in Novigrad, which probably didn't have as many. While uh, Belen had a few, I think. Um, I can't see the spoils of war. Maybe they're up the top. Yep. Uh, they might be further in this side, I guess. Ah, they might be around the back there. If we head down a uh, deck, I might. Yeah, there we go. Okay, pretty much nothing, but I think the ingots are useful for building Witcher gear. So, that's good. Yeah. Well, I think we have to swim around, which isn't so good. There is a thing that's about to attack us while I'm diving. Just for the instant kill. And so we don't drown from it just attacking our legs or something. Right, can I get up this way? Yeah. Nice. It's gonna allow us to just skip the corner back to our boat. I could have taken the boat all the way around. Might have been the better way to do things. Nice. Okay, we're still alive. A quick save while I remember. Let's get back in our slowly sinking boat. And, uh, yeah. Go over to Ceres. It should be. I think that's Spickrog over there, right? Yep, that's the edge of Spick. Krog. I don't know why it's glitching out so much right now. I wonder if it's got one of those, um, usually see them in Bethesda games, but like, it'll just slowly start dying. Like, the longer your save file goes on. Now, that's usually the Bethesda game special. Is like, the longer your save file goes on, the more chance there is that you're going to run into something game break. But I don't remember hearing anything about that with the Witcher, so... Interesting. Ooh, there's some snow around. It's probably not good given we've heard about the uh, wild hunt ship that may or may not just come and kill us. Made of uh, fingernails. I did notice that the shadow from our ship is so like long and I was thinking, wait a second, is the sun the other side? Are we actually being followed by a giant ship? No. Nope, we're not. But, you know, no, no need to not be cautious. There are a few islands out there. I assume that they're just there for, like, decoration. Because that's not Spickerol. Because this is Spickerol. They're up to the north. We can't see them on our map, so they probably don't exist. But no, they do exist. Why did I assume that? I was like, that's as far north as we can go. No. There are totally a bunch of islands up there. I guess undiscovered locations don't fully fill in until you're nearby. Or nearby-ish. I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Wait, do you see... Wait a second. Did you see that? I was sure that I saw the whale right below us. I was sure I saw the shadow of a whale. I'm, I'm just crazy, I guess. Okay. Well, get back in the boat. And, uh, yeah. Just go on the trip to Spickrog get there, and everything will be fine. Um, are we going to be... It's like we're going to land in the harbour if we go this way. We probably want to go around the coast slightly. Although if we got onto the land, we could probably just take it, like, just go over the top. Eh, doesn't really matter either way. Oh. Except on land, you don't have to deal with these guys every ten seconds. Oh, you know what I could do? No, get the horn out. Oh, apparently you just can't use that horn on land? Okay, fine. Or on boat. Get, get off the boat. Daryl. Use the horn. Well, that'll get rid of that siren. Nice. 
The other one's not even gonna come close. Works well for me. Ooh, didn't want to go back in the water. Nope, apparently can't go up that way. Gotta go round ever so slightly. There we go. This is slightly quicker than going on the boat, I think. At least it seems quicker. Uh, oh, I mean, if I don't get trapped on things. If we head up this way, we we'll probably head in around the back of Spicker Rock. Yeah. I do want to head in the front, however, because I don't want to miss a cutscene like I did on the other one. Balls and two of them. What good would letting balls be? Uh, uh, up this way. So what do we do? Go to the truth? Oh, there's, there's a quest. I want the quest, please. Please let me climb the... Oh, wait. We can head this way, right? This almost works. Yeah, we'll head this way and talk to the people with the quest. Hello. Druids aren't any good with wraiths. Oh, suppose you're better. Shut your gob. He's better than any. That's a witcher there. Listen, it's our arena. We've got a wraith that haunts it. Damned if we know how to drive it off. Do you think you could manage? Yeah, sure. This wraith, I can probably manage it. Need the details. What do you want to know? Well... How about the arena? Tell me about it. What kind of an arena is this? It's an arena, like any other. The custom was for the best warriors to clash here. Speaker of boats were famous all across Skellige. Then one day a wraith showed up. How did you know? Told you. He's a witcher. A cunning man. He knows these things. Okay, what kind of wraith? Know anything about this spectre? When did it first appear? My granddad told me his granddad said the rape was called Ula the Unlucky. Lost every boat he entered, yet all was recovered from his wounds. Ula weren't even able to die like a man. Till one day, Jarl Thormar called a tournament in the arena. In those days, they drew lots to choose their foes, and the Jarl drew Ula the Unlucky. Jarl was cocksure he'd win, so he mocked. Ula ridiculed him till all in the stands were crying with laughter. <laughs> Finally, he raised his arms in triumph, and that's when Ula, who couldn't take it no more, stuck a dagger in his back. As he died, Thoma cursed Ula. May ye lose again and again for centuries on end. That's what he said. Ever since, Ula's haunted the arena, looking for a fight and getting a few. Mean there have been those who've tried to defeat him? You kidding? Everyone's beating him. Poor bugger keeps coming back, though. Can't organize no normal fights precisely because of that. Ah, all right. Well, I'll take the job. All right. Could try my hand at driving away this specter. Not for free, though. Get it done, and we'll pay you the champion's purse. And a premium from our earnings to come. Once the fighting begins... After the curse is lifted. Oh, sure you're not getting carried away there. Nah, little I, but fuck it. Witcher gets rid of the rate. He'll deserve a premium from the earnings, he will. So be it. One time only, though. Sounds reasonable. Wait for me here. Shouldn't be too long. Uh, all right. Where is... Oh, here, here it is. Well, there we go. That was easy enough. Um, hello there. Come to face the ghost of the arena. Don't be shy. I'll defeat Ula the Unlucky. Just spare me your jabber. Your cries have died, Wraith, and I shall defeat you, Spectre of the Arena. I've heard them all a thousand times. Dreadful sick of them. Uh, you seem a bit bored. You're no typical Wraith. Why not? Because I don't shriek threats and warn you of your death? Well, that's simple enough. Plain bored of that. Besides, I know how to be. You'll spit out some insults, pierce me with your sword, and I'll then disappear, only to be back here again in a few days. And it'll be so with those who come after you. Such is my fate. I'm to tarry here till the world's end. 
losing every fate along the way. But you've not come to chat. Draw it, swing it, get to work and defeat the ghost of the arena. No. Not gonna be any fight. Have it your way. If not you, then the one to come after. It is all the same to me. Every man defeats Ula the I want to try something, but do. I felt I had to save first. Come. Hey, Ula, draw your weapon. Draw your weapon. Drawing, drawing. But make it quick. And not too much drama if you don't mind. Let's dance. There's a reason I'm saving first. Kill me. I defeated you. Seems so. Congratulations. But what happened? I was to lose till the end of time. What's that? I hear. I hear. Laughter and joyous cries. The clanking of chalices and a and a voice summoning me to the feast of heroes. You, you let me win. You freed me. Thank you. The gods be with you. Farewell, ghost. That was good. I like that puzzle. I don't like being incredibly injured afterwards, but I liked it. Hey, solved your problem. Greetings. Ghost shouldn't pester you anymore. Drinking meat with his ancestors by now. I knew you'd manage it. Well, Gunnar, me winning. Here. You bet on it? Should have seen it. I said you'd pull it off. Gunnar said there weren't a chance. That's why he's got that sheep's arse frown now. See that frown often, when it's time for me to get paid. You needn't fret. We're honorable folk here. This is for you. And remember, you get a cut of the earnings once we get the arena up and running again. I'll remember that. So long. Oh, we've got to return later and we will get a percentage of our earnings. Interesting. Um, but we'll move out of the way of that guy. Anyway. Thank you for watching, I'm going to end the episode here, and then next time, as we're already on the island, we'll go and speak to Saris. See you then. Goodbye.